contains chapter 1 first day of school narrated by sneha vijayala chapter 1 first day of school today was my first day at sunny coast primary school i was nervous like everyone else thinking various things like will others like me will they make fun of me normally in preschool i was the last to come to class since today is the first day of primary school i made it to sunny coast quite early when I went to my class, I was horrified to see the children. They were all shouting and playing inside the class. I got seated in a corner and watched the others playing. Just then, a girl who looked pale and nervous came and got seated next to me. I got to know that her name was Hazel when she introduced herself to me. I also introduced myself, saying my name was Jasira. Right after that, our teacher, Miss Binney, who had been to our school office, came and greeted us, introduced her, and asked us to introduce ourselves. At first glance, Miss Binney struck me as a very kind, loving, helpful and hardworking. Miss Binney was a stunning teacher. She had beautiful straight and blonde hair, blue eyes and rosy lips. She was tall and thin and was fair. After introducing us, Miss Binney started the lesson. She gave us some simple subtraction. I finished them quickly and showed them to her and she praised me saying, Oh, you finished them quickly and all are correct. Well done, Jasira. Hazel completed them second. Half of the class did the subtraction without help, but some couldn't. So Miss Binney taught them how it's done kindly. Next, Miss Binney gave us books and asked us to read them aloud. The book I got was The Ugly Duckling, which I had read before with the help of my mom. I started reading, Once Upon a Time, The End. Miss Binney told me that my reading was perfect. She also said that Hazel's reading was perfect too. Almost everybody reads well. Next was the interval. Hazel and I shared our snacks and ate. Then we went to the playground to play. Sunny Coast Primary School has two playgrounds. One, which was very big and had many children, played and did sports there. The other one was small and used by first and second graders, and it had swings, slides, seesaws and other play equipment. There were two swimming pools too. Miss Binney said that we have a swimming period on Tuesdays and Fridays, which sounded really nice to me. After the interval, Miss Binney gave us five sentences for the topic, myself. It took me around five minutes to write it. Miss Binney read and was elated and said, Wow, this is awesome, Jasira. I was jubilant. Hazel did well in it too. Miss Binney was ecstatic that everyone had written it nicely. She said we did simple things today because it was the first day and we'd have a timetable starting tomorrow that we'd have to follow. Although others didn't like it, Hazel and I thought it was good. Then the bell rang and school was finished. My mother came to pick me up. I really enjoyed today. Thus ended today, the first day of Sunny Coast Primary School.